Natalie, and today I'm going to show you how to archive an activity in your Seesaw Activity Library and how to restore an archived activity if you'd like to reuse it. If you have an activity that you no longer want to appear in your activity library, you can archive it. To archive an activity, first tap the Activities tab located right here. Then tap the three little dot button on the bottom right corner of the activity you would like to archive. Select Archive Activity. If the activity was customized from the Seesaw Activity Library, you will still be able to access the original activity in the Activity Library. You're only archiving your customized version. If students have responded to an activity, their responses will not be archived. They will stay in the student journals. If an activity doesn't have any student responses, you will not be able to archive the activity. Instead, you will see the option to delete the activity in the bottom right corner here. Tapping Delete Activity will permanently delete the activity. Now I'm going to show you how to unarchive an archived activity. If you want to use an archived activity again, you can restore it to your activity library through student responses. To restore an archived activity, first navigate to a student response to the activity in the class journal. Then, tap the grade in response to bar at the top of the activity, right here. Tap the three little dot button in the bottom right corner here, and select Edit Activity. Tap the Preview button. Then tap Share to reshare the activity. This will make it available in the Activities tab. Now you know how to schedule an activity and how to restore an archived activity. If you have other Seesaw questions, visit our Help Center at help.seesaw.me and check out our social media channels for tips and tricks for using Seesaw in your classroom.